Christina is here with us today at the Athletic Studio in Flatiron. She'll be taking us through our happy hour cardio dance workout. Let's shimmy and shake. We've got Lexi, Kristen, and Lauren, and we are at Athleta in Flatiron in New York City, and I am here to teach all of us uh, a full body dance routine. This will hone your entire body, and I know sometimes we freak out when we have dance moves because coordination and rhythm and all this other crap will left, but we don't have to worry about any of that. So I do not care if you're going to the left, to the right, up or down, or you can't qu handle the arms, just do the best you can. Calories don't know the difference, right? Yes. And it's about having fun. And the other thing that I absolutely swear by is you have to bring your heart into the move, right? Bring all of yourself into the move so it's not just moving arms and legs, right? But it's the whole body. We'll start with the warm up. So legs are parallel. Inhale up, exhale round the spine and contract. So just deep inhale up, exhale round. Now you'll notice the tailbone goes under you and you round the spine like you're kind of giving a big hug and the tailbone drops. That's it, you guys. Two counts up. Who counts down? Exhale. One more. Hands to the floor. Lift your hips up and relax the back of your neck. Let your head dangle. Now just start to bend your knees. Bend your knees, stretch your legs. So deeply, just to warm up the joints. Right, all the way. Go, bend, stretch. Go four, three, two more. Soften through the knees. Pull the abs in. Roll up nice and slow through the spine. Shoulders and head come up last. Now just start to switch, shift your weight. So you'll notice I kind of press the heel onto the floor, right? And you start to sit into the hip. That's it. And then you're gonna start to move the shoulders and the arms. So just wave it back. So you get a little bit of torso movement, right? Energy through the fingers. That's it. Eight, six, four more. Yes, ladies. Now the rhythm shifts. Shift it up so it goes up. So you start to point that foot. So you start to reach all the way through the toe. Yes, add the arm reaching across. So you start to feel an X across your tummy, which is carving out that belly of yours. Yeah, go eight like this. Really reach, right? Really stretch right from the beginning. Keep the legs, arm switch to a little side sway. You start to feel your back and your obliques. Woo! Yeah, for eight like this. Six. We're gonna come into a lunge and contract. Interlace your hands, press your palms, right? And you're gonna open up, lift the chest, and open the arms. Again, a little faster, contract, push. Open, lift. Again, contract, push. And this is the same contraction as before, where the tailbone's under you. That's it, let's see, good. So tailbone under, waistline back, perfect. Two more like that, contract, push. Heart up, one more. Now you're just gonna drop swing your arms, so they go drop swing and plie the legs. So you get a feeling of like a little momentum swing, like a drop swing. It should be kind of fun, like a woo, and up, yeah? <laughs> exactly, that's it, Lauren. <laughs> now we go faster with these arms, with a plie, eight times. Six, four, we're gonna come into a lunge facing the wall, so you contract, push, and open. Same series, contract, push. Back knee to floor, back heel is up. Two more, push. Nice and slow, one more, push. Now just your front arm, left arm stays, you're gonna drop swing. Down and up, ha, right, go low and go high. Now faster, on the beat, down, up. Right, so you swing, it's like I'm not throwing a baseball, but I never played baseball, clearly. <laughs> <laughs> baseball matches around the world are like rolling their eyes. Yeah, now arms out, knee comes in, pull it in and reach it. So start by just reaching your arms on diagonal, now it's slow. The second you push your foot off the floor, it points, and you start pulling the belly in. Add the arms, pull the back, right? Now what I'm talking about with the heart is not this, right? This won't cut it, <laughs> right? You gotta go whoa, out, right? All the way in with your whole being, right? Mind, body, and spirit, which is what dancing is all about, which is why I love it so freaking much. Keep the arms up, faster leg, go in. Take your downstage arm, the one closest to me, to the hip, and take the other arm out to a V. Take the elbow across. 
So you get a little twist going through the bot. Yes, ladies, eight more. Six, good, four. Other side in your lunge, contract. It goes contract, push, open up. This is our warm up. Contract, push, right, open the heart. Two more, and up, one more. You're gonna drop swing slow with that front arm only. Down and up, ah, down and up, yes. Now we go faster. Let the momentum take you, right? Up, seven, four more. Both arms up, just the knees, slow. Go in, pull it in. Heart lifted, right? Arms open, upper arm by ear. Pull it in, pointing that toe as soon as it comes off the floor and feeling your back leg stabilize you. Add your arms, pull them in all the way, right? Nothing halfway, full mind, body, spirit working, right? Four more, go, four, slow, three, that's it ladies, two, arms stay up, knee goes fast, here we go, pull in. Now your down stage arm, arm closest to me, comes to your hip, other arm to a V, add the arm, twist it, pull, all the way across, yes, just four more, three more, hands to hip, knees march up, lift, Woo. so belly in, yeah, this is like an attitude position in dance, so the knee is slightly bent. Right, and now the second you lift the foot off the floor, it points. So you start to carve out the ankle, because we care about everything, yes? <laughs> lift, lift. We're gonna go up and up. Ooh, arms go up, interlace the hands. Just press down to your thighs, press. You can get a little twist towards that leg, right? Eight more, and six. Nice, ladies, four more. Woo, we get to sprint it out, fast feet. So you just get to run it out. There's no like, quality here for after, after like that flash dance moment, right? Like getting out your sillies moment, right? Pull the belly in, but you gotta run for your whole life. Yeah, so eight, seven, woo, six, and five, four, three, two, done. Good. We're warm. We're gonna really dance now, ready? So I'm gonna start to teach you some moves. The first one I'll start slow. So you go one, two, three, and four, five, six, seven and eight. Now, important while learning, where your weight is. The weight goes on each foot, you'll notice, yeah? So it goes one, two, three, and four. Five, six, seven, and eight. Ah, uh, one, put weight on each foot. Ah, uh, ba, da, da. Yes, step. Woo, good. Arms go. So you start thinking and tossing your hip, right? Toss the hip. I said, eight. Yes. One, two, this is slow. We're gonna take it up a notch. It'll actually be easier. Just think right, left, right, left. So it was one, two, three, and four. Right? That's it. So you wanna step out. Step out. Switch your leg, Lexi. Open the leg, open the leg. Yes. Ah, oh, perfect. So for dancers, right, it's like, not a quasi position with the leg crossing, but it's an open position in the body. Yes. And just swing those arms. Right, so go swing. It's like your hips are taking over. Yeah? It's like, whoa! Good. That's it, so full body. Three. Yes, two, you guys ready to move on? Next move, we go. Stomp, pull it up, and step it back. Stomp, pull it up, step it back. One, two, pull. Five, six, seven, eight. One, do with me. A five, six, seven, eight. One, two, ha. A five, six, seven, eight. One, ha. And you'll notice my arms throw it up to the world, right? A one, ha. Yeah? Again. A one, ha. Yes. With the vocalization, I love it. One, ha. Down. Good. One more. Now you're just going to add on a little bit. It's a little ball change, ball change. So it goes one, two, three, and four. Yes, again. One, two, three, and four. And you'll notice my arms go up, and they dive down. It's like they're putting them in a shirt. A one, up, down, and down. Good, again. One, up, down, and down. Oh, we're grooving. One more. One, up. Now, just the left foot, just the down and up. Down, throw it up, and step it back. Six, left leg. Down, up, step it back. I know, right? So when you start the other side, right, it feels brand spanking new again. <laughs> That's all good, right? Here we go. Down, I love it. Back, hold. Down, up, back, hold. 
Two more like that. Plus, back and hold. Oh, yes, we got this hold. We're gonna add that ball change, ball change. Here we go. Down, up, back and back. Six, seven, eight. I want up, back and back. One, up, back and back. Ooh, one more right here. We're gonna go from one side to the other. Here we go. Uh, down, up, other side. Oh, doesn't that feel good? Almost. Yes, a one. Yes, go. Right, down, up, face. Stomp and throw. Stomp and throw. Yes. We are having a blast over here, right? Hope you guys are having a blast too. Three more. Two. We're gonna put it together with the first move. Toss the hip. One. Remember this one? <laughs> Feels like it was ages ago. Yeah. Four more like that. Four. Yeah. We're gonna stomp and throw it up. You guys ready? Here we go. Go stomp, throw, back and back. Good. Next move. We go. Out, out, in, in. Touch and touch. Again, like that. Out, out, in, in, yes, and touch. That helps me too when I say it out loud, right? You go out, out, in, in, and we touch. Good. One more time. Yes, with that. Out, out, in, in, and we touch. Woo, good. Faster. So go out, out, in, in, touch. Good. Nailing it. <laughs> yeah, again. Out, out, and touch. Now we gotta add our charisma and our power behind it. Out, hands to prayer, and they do a little dive. Oh. Out, and in, little whoop, whoop. Yes. yes. So we go out, we gotta live our life. We gotta go out, oh, and in. Little jive, little jive. Good. Out, and in. Yes, you guys, feeling it. Two more. One more. We're gonna go back to our stomp and throw it up. Yeah, stomp, throw it up, down and down. Get ready, reach it back, here we go, reach it back. Two steps. Again. Two more, reach. One more. Now we get to do a little shimmy. It goes up, up, down. So just focus on the hips first. One, two, three. One, two, three. Oh yeah. Booty, booty down. Booty, booty down. Yes. Now, you're gonna have a little releve and then you just land on that one heel. So releve is just coming up to the balls of your feet. Shimmy, shimmy down. Oh yeah, and it's like kind of subtle. So you're not like giving it all away, right? Like a little, ugh, a little sassy, a little subtle. Arms out and it's like, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Sort of like the sun's hitting your chest or on the beach, it's like a, I was gonna say, freaking awesome day, yeah? Throw the head a little bit. Da, da, ah, da, da, ah. Oh, yes. Good, for eight, six, four. We're gonna reach it back and two taps. Put it together. Jive it out. Again, reach it, pull it in and jive it. Two more. One more here. Now we have our subtle shimmy. It goes up, up, down, up, up, down. Four, three, two, the next and last step just goes up and down. So I kind of like roll through the balls of my feet and the hips go up to down, like kind of like a little circle. Woo, woo. All right, they kind of have this feeling to it. That's it. Now just the arms, slow the arms. They go up, smack it down. Yeah, so it's like a, like kind of like a conductor. A whip? Yeah, like a whip too. Now you're gonna do the arms a little faster. So it goes up, ba, up, ba. Yeah, like you're hitting a drum. Ha. So you're gonna put it together with the leg. So it goes up, ha, ha. Yes, four, three. Back to our subtle shimmy. So it's one, two, three. Four. Now go ahead, whip and jump. Seven. Four, three, two, give me a little step touch, ladies. Now, step touch is a great way to sort of like check in with like how much you're giving into the moves, right? Because a step touch we all can do, right? There's no discrimination with a step touch, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. So put your body into it. 
Fine, make it feel good, make it feel like you. There's no definition of what it looks like, right? It's you. So this is the spirit, when you feel this free, that you bring into the rest of the dance, yeah? Super important, because that's when real results start to happen in your body, but also in your like person, right? Yes. Woo. Yes. I'm up for a good step clap. All right, ladies, bring it to me in place. Just go down. You're gonna feel this rhythm in your beat, yeah? In your leg. Woo, good. Now, do you remember all those moves? We're gonna put them all together, yes? Yeah? Into our dance. Here we go, in five, in six, in seven, here we go, step in, hip toss. You're gonna stomp and throw it up. It goes, up and down and down. Up and down and down. Reach it back, it goes. Two steps, ha, again. Go ahead, again. One more. Subtle shimmy, here we go. Ah, ta, ah, up and down. Four. Jump it out, here we go. Eight. Four, three from the top, here we go. Swing those hips, boom. Good, now travel, All right, move. Stomp it forward, here we go. Hop. And you're gonna reach it back. Two steps. Twice more. One more. Subtle shimmy. Ah, up, up, down. Four. From the jump, it goes. Four. Three last time, ladies. All you got. Here we go. Right, no rules. Just lived in. Now stomp it up. Ha! Ha! Yes! Reach it back for all you got. Here we go. Two steps. Work it out. And jive. And. And jive. One more. Shimmy it out. Ah. Four. Jump it out, here we go. Final four jumps. Three, two, one. Ooh, Woo! yeah. 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 Very, very good, high fives all around. Oh my God. Kick ass. <laughs> Thank you so much for sweating with me, you guys and you at home. Yes, go ahead, dance your hearts out and move your body. Hey guys, we're with Christina from Living Dance here at Athleta. We just had an awesome, oh my goodness, so amazing and sweaty dance sesh together. Yeah. And yeah, we really had a great time. I hope you guys had a great time too, following along. So now we get to speak with Christina about cardio dance and you know, just tell me about it. What, what's your favorite part about cardio dance? Ah, oh, goodness. There's so many parts that I absolutely <laughs> love. My favorite thing about cardio dance and just dancing in general is that it involves your mind, your body, and your spirit. Like you can't leave any one of those components out because I mm -hmm. feel like as soon as you do, you're just doing like random moves. Then I feel like it gets into like the, I don't want to say this in a negative way, but like working out. And it, to me, it's, it's, um, it makes me feel good, it works my body, and I have to think, there's coordination involved. And I just love that like there's no way to avoid bringing my whole person into a session um, of dance cardio or just dancing in general. So to me, that that's the best part. <laughs> I love that. We, yeah. <laughs> we were smiling the whole time. You know, sometimes we mess up and that's fine. I mean, I'm sure you have advice to people who have never danced before. Like, you know, coming to take one of these classes, I'm sure it, it might be intimidating if you've never taken a dance class before. So what kind of advice would you give to these people? Absolutely. I mean, I feel like there's so many women who, A, have never danced before who come to try to take my class or also um, haven't danced in a really long time and want to come and take the class. Um, and there's so many, you know, when people hear of dancing, they think, oh, gosh, I need rhythm. I need coordination. Yeah. <laughs> I, need, I need all these things that I clearly don't have. And it doesn't have to be about that. To me, dancing is about expression. It's about bringing yourself to the the table so I always say it doesn't matter left foot right foot if you can't do the arms don't worry about it like your body doesn't know the difference right and in all of that stuff actually comes I do a lot of moves on repeat so I always say that like I break the moves down I do right. them on repeat um, 
and each class is kind of self-contained. So you don't have to have done the class prior. Like the moves that you're doing okay. for that class are the moves that you're doing for that class, so there's no judgment. And I just try to keep it a no judgment free zone, like for yourself on you, and also just like you don't have to worry about anybody else looking or, right. or me being like, that's <laughs> not it. Like I, I really will never be like, that's not it. I'll be like, okay, we can do this. So I, I kind of like to approach it from that from that's, that angle. Yeah, that's how we felt. You know, we didn't feel judged at all. We were having a great, <laughs> great time. So uh, what kind of different dance moves do you put into your routines? Do you take from different styles of dance or things you've learned in the past? Um, so my background has been a modern dancer. Um, modern, I train in modern ballet and theatrical and jazz dancing. So I bring that background into whatever it is that I'm teaching. Um, and a little bit of like hip hop back in the day when I was young. I always say like my ballet training has reversed my coolness or like my hip hop, but I bring, I try to bring as much of that into the equation. So I never think of it necessarily just as like cardio moves, but I just try to think of it, okay, what moves do I like to do to this song? What gets me moving? And I'll, I'll just take from that background that I have. Nice. Yeah. Do you have any specific favorite song that you really like to dance to? Oh, so many favorite songs. Okay. Um, well, one thing comes to mind, which is kind of like a side note, but my friend Mario Spinetti is an amazing uh, vocalist, and he creates amazing music, and the two of us are actually collaborating. So he, he creates these beautiful songs that really move me, and then I create like artistic dances to them. So, wow. we, so that's more of something that I do like professionally and as a way of performance. So I always love moving my body to his music because he's a, he's a soulful, per, soulful person. But something, if it was just more like dancey and like just kind of like turning it on in my house, um, there's a song like Gabriel uh, by Roy Davis Jr. It's like a dance mix, but it was it is the song that I put on like before I perform. If I like want, if I'm having a bad day or need to get like out of a mood, mm -hmm. I just play that song and it like I just like freestyle to it and it like puts me in the best mood. So. Uh -huh. I would say Mario's music or or that song Gabriel really right, does, yeah, does it for me. I'll have to check that out. Yeah, please do, please do. Thank you for speaking with me today and yeah. thank you for leading this awesome, awesome workout but dance cardio session. We loved it. So guys, catch us at the next workout. One. That dance cardio was next level. <laughs> it's lit. <laughs> I'm just kidding, but it really was so much fun. We, we had smiles on our faces the whole time. The whole time. We're going to shimmy our way on to the rest of our day. <laughs> we hope you had a great time, and we'll see you next time on City Shape Up. Up.